We're going to go food excursion today. We're going to get them dirty burgers. This is a this is a food trip right now. Y'all want to see a kid that won't quit? Look at that kid. Look at that kid. Look at look he fell out his shoe. He fell out his shoe again. Back in the car, and we're about to head up to our excursion to get a dirty but right a dirty burger, right? Yes. That's Thomas Fam right there, baby. How you doing? So what are we gonna eat? I love to eat. So we're the theme of today's uh, excursion is dirty burgers through drive-ins. Like I want like the old school drive-ins, like when they get up on like when they walk up to your car and order food. That's what I want. So that's where we're going. Like, I need to ride, Mama. Right. Okay, this one drive-in that we're about to go to that I hope it's open. I hope it ain't shut down. <laughs> I haven't been here since I was a little kid. I ain't been here since I was like maybe seven or eight. And we're gonna see if the food's gonna still be the same way. She says she wanted, my wife, Thomas Fun says she wanted a dirty burger, right? Mm -hmm. So we're gonna get a dirty burger today. I'd love to eat. By the way, if everybody check out, if you're checking out my picture right now, it says, it says I love bacon. I heart <laughs> bacon. Listen, bacon's real to me. It's like real. I know I might have a heart attack by the time I'm like 60, but it's okay. I go out happy with thank you. <laughs> so we're at the fabulous R.O.'s barbecue slot. We just ordered our food. And I just want to let y'all look at that little sign right there. It says blow horn for carb service. That's how you know you eat in the South. Hopefully this food's really good. I mean, like, this is actually, actually, I'm going to go ahead and self-promote this place. This is the R.O.'s barbecue slaw that you find in the grocery store that says R.O.'s slaw, like the stuff that's in there. This is it right here. This is the place. Went here with a little kid. I don't remember this place. But any place that serves homemade uh, cherry lemon sun drops is a great place for me. Hopefully, they give me, like, the little sores, like, I'm not the little kid and all. But yeah, other than that, it'll be good. Right now, we just we just ordered our food. We got we got a bunch of food from Aro's Barbecue Stall. Um, the price is kind of expensive. Like you would think they have like combo meals, like eight ninety nine for a combo meal, but they charge you for everything. Well, all I but, but the burger. This is a this is a cheeseburger all the way burger. Oh man, look at that burger. Look at that. That's delicious out there. It's, I mean, this, oh. Thomas Funds told me, here's the, uh, get you a good, you get you a good, but I will say, this gets you a good portion, onion rings, uh, fries, homemade channel and sun drop. Oh, check this out. This is, this is, this is what they're notorious for. This is the R.O.'s barbecue sandwich. This is, Every time I come to Ar Anaro's, you gotta get a barbecue sandwich. Can we get a hush puppies for Get a hush puppies. Uh, let's try the drink. And. What's, what's this, honey? That is a cheeseburger, lettuce, tomato, pickles, and onions. A lot of lettuce. A lot of lettuce. Alright, let me take this first bite. Uh, see how this tastes, and I'll give you a. Oh yes, it's dirty burger. Mm. How is it, honey? All my life, I've been waiting for this burger. It's so big. Yeah, she's pregnant right now. So, <laughs> no, I'm so Dylan Thomas, Dylan D D Thomas comes out June eighteenth, but. Better be expecting. Let, let's make this place famous. On third, if you don't, if you want a good bar burger, a good barbecue sandwich, a good food, thirteen eighteen Gaston Avenue, Aro's Barbecue, Aro's Barbecue, 
And Gastonia, North Carolina is a place to get some good food. And if they know some things that we don't know. And hey, subscribe on the video. If, if you find any uh, restaurants, dirty burgers, or anything, hit me with some comments below. I'm P. Thomas. She's Thomas Fun. Peace. That burger, I don't know if y'all noticed, I got some barbecue sauce right there. That burger's really a dirty burger. Like, it's very good, but it is messy. That's why they gave us this many napkins. This ain't even the one we used, but we've done used almost half of it. Now, it is for the Holy Grail of Grills. The, and I mean the, R.O.'s Barbecue Chef. That's what you said. All right, we just got done eating our dirty burger, and I really want. I got a sweet tooth. So now we are on the best place. We are on the. We are. On, we are on our way to find a good donut. Something sweet. Something sweet. But not too much sweet. But not too sweet. So we just discovered the, the donut. Now, I don't know about y'all. I like a donut, and I like the like. The Boston cream donuts are like. What kind of donut do you like? The regular one. You like the plain? Yeah, the plain one. I love the plain one. He probably likes the sprinkles. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so. I'm going to get a donut. I'm at a red light right now. That's Riley's world. That's Riley's world. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now we're back home. I'm in my cozy bed, about to go night night. My tummy's full of delicious dirty burgers and donuts. So check me out later. <laughs>